For example, watch this. All my fingers are down and I will, I will take a screenshot with my iPhone. It can work on any iPhone, guys. iOS 14 and Apple, iOS 15. Watch this. Do you see a screenshot? Let's do it. Let's just plug it in and hear what, what the sound will be. One, two, three. Charging. You see, it's a charging when it starts charging. Hi everyone, in today's video I will share with you hidden features that will make a difference in your lifestyle. Guys, there is so many YouTube videos on hidden features, I choose only the, the one that will make a difference on daily use that you're gonna thank me at least for one of them if not for all. So let's start right now. Look what I'm gonna do right now. For example, watch this. All my fingers are down and I will, I will take a screenshot with my iPhone. It can work on any iPhone, guys iOS 14 and Apple, iOS 15. Watch this. Do you see a screenshot? It just took a screenshot. How did they did this? And much more into the video right now. So we're starting with the screenshot. How did they took the screenshot without touching the buttons on the side of the phone? As we all know, all you have to do is go to setting and now scroll down to accessibility, click on it, and then you look for touch. You see touch, click on touch and you scroll all the way down and you have a back tap, which means you are tapping on double or triple tapping on the back of the phone. So you can choose a lot of options what gonna happen with the phone if you back tap double or triple. So I choose for the double, double tapping screenshot. But as you see from the top, it has the first one, app switcher, control center, home, home. you can go back home, lock screen, you can mute, uh, notification center, reachability, screenshot, shake, you know, shake it's for undo when you're typing. Uh, so it's good if you don't wanna shake, for any reason you can just double tap the, the back of the phone. By, way, by the way, it's working for iOS 14 and now iOS 15. Spotlight, volume down, volume up, uh, sensitivity touch, which means it's, uh, you know, it's the, like the home button on the, on the screen. A classic invert, magnifier, smart invert, invert for, for, for black uh, background, speak screen, voiceover, zoom, scroll down, scroll up and so on guys there is so much you can play with this and be creator creative so triple tap same thing you can choose one of those options okay that's only number one number two guys is going to safari as you see right now on safari i always knew that in order to close all tabs i have to swipe uh, right or left but my friend showed me if you put your finger hold your finger on the same spot where you open the tabs pop up window will come up saying close all 45 tabs or close only one tab so guys that's amazing again just hold your finger on it for about a second and that then you can close all of them all the uh, open tabs let's close them right now with this uh, method so let's just uh, hold it and then close all 45 tabs it's asking you if you want to close them, yes, and now, uh, after one day, automatically close tabs. After one day, after one week, after one month, don't close automatically. That's what I will choose, don't close automatically, but now we have no tabs. Now, the third one is when you're plugging the phone into a charger, it will say whatever you want it to say. You can tell them to say charging, you can tell the phone to say be creative song that you like so let's do it let's just plug it in and hear what what's the sound will be one two three charging you see it's a charging when it starts charging so how do i do that let's jump into the screen inside the phone so all you have to do is go into shortcut application that built into the phone you see over here on the screen shortcut and then you go on the bottom it said my shortcuts animation or gallery you pre you you uh, uh, click on animation and then go on the plus on the top plus sign and then create personal animation and then you scroll all the way down 
to charger. You see charger on the bottom? And now you can make it say when you connect it and when you disconnect it, whatever you are gonna set it up to say. So let's do next right now. And now add action. And now on add action and search, you write speak text. You see on the bottom speak text. And now you gonna write whatever you want it to say and it will say when disconnecting or connecting. You choose. Okay, so let's write now, let's uh, type um, thanks for watching. Now hit done on the, on the keyboard and now you can hear it, how it sounds. And now you hit next and then ask before running, you, you shut it off, you don't want it to ask because then it's not gonna do it automatically. And then you hit done. And now when you connect or disconnect the phone, it will say, thanks for watching. So now that we set it up to say thanks for watching, let's hear how it sounds, guys. Let's connect it right now. And it's here, my, my microphone is here, so let's do it. Thanks for watching. You see all these pages? Most of them we are not using on the daily use. So how can we clean the iPhone uh, interface that we should have only one page or two pages and not a lot of pages? Okay, so you just press on the empty space on the screen and then you, sp you press over here on one of those dots, those, those dots. And now, whatever you want to disappear, page that you want, you want, it, to, you want it to disappear, you just click uh, and take off the V. Okay, so let's just leave one and we can have only two pages right now. Watch this one, two, three. It's already the library apps. So if you want to disappear all of them, all you, all you have to do is, is go back and disappear. Sorry, go back and disappear all of them. And now let's go back and let's see. We have no pages. If you want to get it back, very simple. Go like this again on the empty space and then just get it back whatever you want. This is number one. Going to number two. How to hide photos but entirely that nobody can even go into your photos somewhere in the setting and find it. So let's see, let's go into the photos and select three photos. And now and these three photos I want to, uh, to hide. What I do is clicking here and then going to hide and then it will hide all these three photos right once he's gonna hide them a person that knows a little bit about the phone and when he took the the phone from you he can find them on albums and go scroll all the way down and then hidden photos and he can find those hidden photos how could you make that he will not see this even over here on the settings in photos app how you do that it's simple you go to setting and you scroll down from the top to photos you scroll down to photos and then you go a little bit down and then you see hidden photos you just uh, shut it off when it's off if you go to photos and now you're not gonna have over here on the bottom you're not gonna have on the bottom hidden photos he's not gonna find what's hidden he is gonna have to go to your setting and he's not gonna do that when you nearby right Hidden feature number three is when you're taking a selfie photo, it's flipping your face. Let me show you what I mean, how it's flipping, what I mean by flipping on the front camera. So I will take a picture, the recording camera, and look how it's gonna flip it. Watch this, let me go into the camera, and now let's go to the front uh, ca uh, camera. Now it's, it's seeing the camera. Now you see over here, it's on the left. On your, on your side, you see the side that is that? I will take a picture right now. And now let's go into the picture. It's flipped it, now it's on this side. So how you do that, that it will not flip it, let me share with you right now. Okay, what you have to do is go to setting. And then from, from the top you scroll down until you see uh, the photos, the camera, sorry, the camera. And then you see mirror front mirror front camera you just turn it on when it's on it will not flip your photo watch this i will take a picture right now again from the camera and let's make it front and now it will not flip it watch this 
and the same side that you took it, same side you stay it. Okay guys, this is how it should work. I hope you found this video helpful and if you do, please subscribe, hit the like button and be there for me and I'll be there for you for the next couple of videos. Thank you, bye.